Good morning, Halumi Station. Did you, did you um, have a good sleep? Yes, I did. Okay, guys, so... <laughs> pangalawang araw ng ating camp trip. Uh, medyo nakakaiba siya dahil ang daming tao. And kung napansin nyo, it's like a, it's like a farmer's market <laughs> by the river. Pero camp style. Speaking of camp style, our menu is based on FIFO. First in, first out. Because since we're in a camp, we don't have enough storage. Kapag punta kang camp, dala ka ng one ref, one freezer. Pero ito kasi, 50 packs eh. We have, di ba sa last na natin mga camp trips, kaya naman. Pero ilan na tayo dun? 20, di ba? Mga ganun. So this time, ito medyo malaki-laki. So kaya, nagbabase siya kung ano na yung critical, meaning ano na yung kailangan talagang lulutuin na, and ano na yung walang storage space, ganun. Pero yung kagandahan naman sa camp community is because it's like a community nga. It's like everyone's just helping out each other. Uh, papahiram ng ganito. Like example, yung friend namin si Carlos. Um, aalis siya today, iwan niya yung freezer niya. So, mas stretch namin. Kasi on Sunday, maraming tayong birthday celebrants. Isa na dyan, yung wife ni Joel. Carolyn, kailangan special siya eh. Kailangan special. Anyways, wala. Balik na tayo dito. Aaron, I'm going to give you a... This is a... Basically, it's like a grilled cheese sandwich. With on halloumi cheese. Oh, that cheese was so good yesterday. Right? Yeah. So what I'm gonna do is I have a... I know, Chavs, where's the jam from again? <laughs> from Baguio, from Senora Mayora. It's a spicy sweet jam. Sobrang sarap siya kasi yung ating keso ay maalat. It's on the salty side. So it complements each other. Pero konti lang ilagay ko kasi medyo may kick ko si jam. It's a good uh, flavor to taste sa umaga. Mountain man things. Wow, that seemed so easy. <laughs> he makes us look uh, like amateurs. <laughs> Instant tent pole. Guys, seriously, sit here, sit here, please. Helping JP set up the breakfast area. I'll just rearrange it, I'll just put it here. Hindi naman. The shade makes sense. Wait, Pero bago mag set up ng breakfast, kailangan ko muna mag freshen up ng konti. Well, nag toothbrush na rin ako kaninang umaga, pero kumain na. Di ba yung first breakfast natin doon? Ito yung second breakfast para ma freshen up ulit tayo. Ah, mm, recharge, rejuvenated, and ready to go. Gum tech. This is not an ad. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Filipino breakfast. Meron pa kaming niluluto na yung from yesterday na tonkatsu na breaded na inadobo namin. At saka diba marami tayong lechon manok kahapon. So may natira yung lechon manok inadobo na rin natin. Kasi kumbaga kailangan natin siya i- Paikutin. Paikutin, yan. Paikutin, paikutin. Bali ginamit natin dito yung ano, yung... So, mga Pinay tayo, mahilig tayo sa mga leftover. So, yeah. ginamit namin dito yung chicken and then yung pork na naka-breading na. Uh -oh. up. And then, yes, chef. And then, ginamit namin, instead of uh, suka, gumamit kami dito ng uh, bini uh, mango vinegar. Luto na? Ay, kakain na! Breakfast, breakfast! <laughs> Alina kayo bago lumamig. Yes. <laughs> For a change, si Aero naman yung papakainin natin kasi all the time siya yung last kumakain. Ngayon ikaw yung una kakain. Rice? Yes, sir. A little bit? Yeah. So this is our leftover uh, tonkatsu from yesterday and leftover lechon manok that we made into an adobo. So, lalapot siya kaagad kasi may breadcrumbs. 
And since Filipino tayo, kailangan may chicharon. Kailangan may tawilis, kailangan may salted egg, and hindi kompleto yung umaga pag walang itlog. Would you like one or two? One, please. One, all right. A little bit of suka for yes. you. I'll put the suka here. Okay. Uh, so what's here? Yeah, please have a seat there. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Grab your service. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Grab your service. Ngayon. While, um, tama na yung shoot mo. Hindi ka tulad ni Ian na sinasagad 24 7. No? Tingnan mo. Ah, oh. Oh. <laughs> Ian, okay ka lang? Ian, 24 7 ka nagtatrabaho, no? Ito, shooter ko, pinaupo ko na. Ay! Sir, I'm going to to the house. i Sobrang cheater nito. Isang pedal lang ako mula malabon. <laughs> Parang angas-angas ko. Parang carnival bro. Watch out song. Dito lang siya, tapos ako, may ganun. Tong-tong. Tapos. Ang chuleta. Parang tampisaw. Oh, you're making your first steps into the water. Kami, we are gonna make an oyster cake. Oh! It's actually Joni's recipe that uh -huh. we're gonna make. And then we will make a grilled shrimp with a calabasa sauce. That's it. Okay, okay. Sige, sige, sige. So serving time is okay. 4 p.m. All right. Shrimp stock to. Shrimp stock. Yung tawilis natin kaninang umaga. Pa ikutin natin ang ingredients. Toge. My strainer, para siempre toge kasi very porous eh, and mat matubig si toge. Kung hindi mo siya is strain, pupunta siya sa niluluto mo, di ba? Tatabang yung food mo. Eto luya at chives going to the oyster cake. Ngayon let's compartmentalize everything, and uh, ngayon nandito may chef tayo na katingin, so hindi talaga tayo pa de. Uh, magkamali. Sa mga gustong mag-chefs or sa mga young cooks natin out there, focus lang kayo sa trabaho nyo. Huwag nyong pansinin yung hepe nyo. Respeto! May, may katrabaho ako dati sa hotel. Oh. Kasi yung pumapasok yung easy namin, oh. executive chef po. Siya oh. nangyayin Superman. Oh. Alam mo bakit Superman? Oh. Na agad yan yung kamay niya, may hawak na basahan. <laughs> Ganun naman palagi. Pupunta yun dito, hindi naman yan mga ngamusta lang eh. May kailangan. May kailangan. Tinatanggal mo lahat para naman. Mukha, mukha talaga akong kawatan eh. Silip-silip lang. Parang di obvious. Gagawin natin sa kalabasa, ihawin natin siya para mas mabango. Ayun, si Job nandun na sa station ni Chavi. Tapos may... Yung kusinero na kala ko mga ngamusta lang ay... Yun, nagdadampot ng mga ingredients. So, okay lang. Yan sa oyster yung chef kanina. Okay. Dito na ako kuha. Gagamitin ko tong oyster oil para malasa. Ay, gagawa tayo ng para kay Chef AJ yung inihaw na gulay. So, mainit na mainit na. Lagay ako ng onions. Pag may budget tayo, damihan nyo na yung onions. Kasi matamis eh. Tapos mahilig talaga tayo sa laurel. Kasi dami siyang... Again, it's very underutilized. Ginagamit lang siya sa adobo normally. Pero actually, dami talaga. Tsaka parang distinctly Filipino siya pag may laurel. 30 seconds to a minute na lang. Para lalo pa siya tumamis. Okay, hulog ako ng crispy tawilis natin. Na dinurug. Since hindi pa nila mahanap yung bagoong talangka na lang muna gamitin natin.
Tapos, lagay ko siya dito sa ating stock. Or, lilipat ko to dito. Tulog. So, talaga pa nang ng favorite vlogger ko, si Chef JP. Tapos, um, bilisan natin kasi si Ian, yun yung... Uh, ibig niyang, uh, yun yung parang signal niya na gutom na gutom na siya. So, bali, ulitin lang natin. Uh, shrimp stock, uh, onions, bay leaf, tapos yung dinurog na tawilis, talangka. Una, naisip ko bagoong para konti lang para may umami. Pero kunin na lang natin yung umami sa patis. Gata or coconut milk. Busin ko na. Lipat natin ito para may lalagyan ka dyan ng mga gamit-gamit. Ah, para. Ah, umalsa. Eye camper. Kapag ganyan kayo na, pwede rin proofing chamber. Basta isasara nyo. Kaya ang eye camper. Ano yan? Maganda airflow niyan. Pero syempre, pag sinara nyo, wala, wala, wala ang airflow. Pero ano? Tinapay na para sa saksyuka natin. Baksa mo, baksa mo. Kunti pa yan. Last 30 minutes, sirahin ko yan. Nawala lang si Joel kasi sinunod niya ang asawa niya. Ginawa niya ng kusina yung bahay ni Joel. Yan. Wala eh. Aalis ka kasi. Kala mo parang malaking mushroom, no? Buksan natin. Ikaw, hulain mo ano to? If it's not a mushroom, then I have no idea. It is a coconut. I've never have guessed. So it's smoked coconut. Yeah, coconut meat. Yeah. Tapos minok. Bango, sir. So how do you use this? What do you do with it? Hey mo. Umami, right? Pupunta yun dito sa gata, kalabasa. So kaya pinapaihaw ko sa kay Chabi yung kalabasa. Gagawa ko ng kalabasa. Na with gata. Pero, smoke. Ito ba yung bird coconut? Ayun, yun. Ngayon, since meron tayong pasyente dito, gagawa ko ng salad for him. Isishred ko to at haluan ko ng mga hong at iba-iba pa dyan. Minsan, sa restaurant, di ba, you have to go out of your way to accommodate vegetarians, vegans, and we have to respect their their uh, dietary needs, so to speak. Even though my restaurant is very, very pork-centric, kaya nasa hospitality tayo eh. Mga doktor, di naman pwede mamili ng pasyente. Pag naluto pa to, tatamis pa yan ng konti. Uh, so interesting, you know what? It tastes like a biscuit. Huh? Yeah. Really? It has that like, that brittleness, but it's also sweet. Huh? And it's thick. Okay, I'm just gonna wait for this to reduce some more. And what I'll do is, I'll make a coconut salad, slice it thinly. Guess what it is? Good. What do you think it is? Nyog. Yes. Ini hawon nyog. Smoke. Ah. Gumagawa ko ng parang kalabasa gata. Tapos, mm. ito yung parang magiging nati smoky pag na paglumambot na to. Mm. So since si AJ ay uh, marami siyang dietary restrictions, sure, kaya napaisip ako na sige gagawa ko ng coconut salad. Mm -hmm. Hindi mm -hmm. nga ako nagchicken or sa ko eh. Oh. Nasa mga loob ko eh, pero okay. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> yung kita mo? Hindi yung kita mo ibig sabihin. Yun yung sinabi ko kanina, Ray. Pagka doktor ka, hindi ka pwede mamili ng pasyente. Tama. That's exactly what he said. Oh. Sinabi niya ba yan? Oo. Oh. Mm -hmm. Ngayon, uh, parehas naman sinabi sa akin kaibigan ng doktor, ang pag doktor ay art form din. Meron kang klaseng treatment na gustong gawin. Sabi niya to, hindi ako doktor ha. In, in, in a way na gusto mo. Ganoon din sa pag-reserve ng pagkain. Pero, ang end result kasi dito is, pag doktor ka, gusto mong gumaling pasyente. Pag gusto nero ka, gusto mong masatisfy yung customer mo. Oh, diba? Oh, so, kung pipilitin mo yung chicken oil mo, oh, para sa isang taong bawal o ayaw mag chicken oil, oh, hindi mo rin siya masasatisfy. Sa bahay, we're cooking for ourselves, yes. for our family. Pero hmm. pag sa restaurant, you're cooking for our customers. Eh. Sometimes, we want things to be done our way. Uh -huh. pero And kailangan lang natin i-remind yung sarili natin. Mm -hmm. Na, okay, hindi lang, hindi lang tayo hindi to. Lang tayo. Lalo, alam mo sa kung natutunan to? Sa level ng anghang. Ah. Doon ko natutunan to. Kasi minsan, yung hindi pa maanghang sa akin, maanghang na maanghang na sa ibang tao. Tama, di ba? Tama. Yan ang pagiging kusinero. At saka parang nasa stretch talaga yung creativity mo. Paano mm. ko mapasarap yeah. yung isang bagay na walang baboy, Yun. na walang... Example, yung mga 
vegan, hindi yeah. pwede yung patis. Imagine, yes. yun yung yun. ultimate umami. Eh. Yes. Kaya nagsaksuka nga ako, di ba? Oh. Sabi ko, paano to? Edi, lahat ng tomato sauce nandun, paano ko ito magagawa? Kung hindi ko oh. lalagyan ng, say, uh, chicken powder or, or shrimp heads. Or patis. Uh, or patis, di ba? Ginawa ko, ginrail ko na lang. For added flavor. Ginrail ko na lang siya. Para may other layer of complexity. And hopefully, mag-translate yun sa, sa dish itself, di ba? At kaya ako nandito ngayon kasi... Kasi gusto ko bang pasarapin yung luto ko. Okay, kuha ka lang. Kwento-kwento muna siya. Kwento-kwento. Tapos pag nakakuha na ng ano, Oo, tapos kuha na siya. Yeah. Oo, oh, oo. Oh. To get to let your guard down muna. Mm, your sales 101! Hindi, <laughs> 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 eto, tulad nito. Kailangan ko ng uh, umami. Uh, and, uh, ano may meatiness doon uh, sa saksyuka natin. Uh, I'm guessing hindi talaga traditional, pero gusto kong lagyan lag- lag- ng mushrooms. Kasi meron sila. At marami marami salamat. Alis na ako. Alam mo, marami naman tayong shrimp. O sige, lahat na. Para malasa. Pero guys, alam ko, niisip nyo ma-overcook to. Oo, ma-overcook to. Mm, wala naman food cost dito sa camp ngayon. At saka, um, marami kami shrimp. And gusto ko lang talaga sumarap to. Pero, pagdating sa R&D, doon na tayo aatras. We work backwards. ba diba? Paano natin siya costing tayo nito taas pero gusto nating lasa ganun doon pa rin hahabulin natin yan kami na bahala noon kaya we work backwards so don't do this at the restaurant <laughs> since na masarap na masarap yung ating seafood on this as always naman so mismo si Mrs. Marbs ang gagawa ng ating oyster cake this is actually recipe ng mom ni Marvin Mm. Bahay lang naman to guys. Nothing fancy. Kaya, yes. kaya yun yung sikreto ni Marbs sa pagligaw niya kay Joni. Yeah. Pinakain niya ng maraming kalaba. <laughs> This is an eggless oyster cake. Yes, you will, we will not huh. use any egg here. Kasi ayaw natin ng malambot. This has to be very, very crispy. Well, it's supposed to be very crispy. So, later, pag kakain na, or nearer the time ng kain, prito natin siya, tapos serve agad. Para it's crispy, tapos bagong luto. You have to drain the oysters. Uh-huh. Kasi matubig sila, di ba? Correct. So, now, when you fry it, hindi siya masyadong matalsik. Uh-huh. Then, you put um, ginger. Ginger lang, para matanggal lang konting lansa. And okay. then, Kuchay. Mm-hmm. This is kuchay. Kung walang kuchay? Um, normally sa labas, it's just toge. Ah. If you can, ano, di ba? Okay. Toge lang. Pero I like kuchay kasi for a little bit of other added flavor. Okay. Plus, para pag nag pag pinay mo siya as, a, as an omelet, uh-huh. nag-net siya together with this. Because what you want is that it's eggless eh. Uh-huh. Di ba? So walang mag-hold it together. Yun lang. Yes. Kasi, uh, kaya nga oyster cake eh. No? Oh. So yung bidang lasa, oyster talaga. Oyster. Supporting kasa. Ayaw natin ng maraming kung ano-ano para ma-appreciate natin yung lasa ng oyster. Yan. It's very tricky lang yung ratio ng toge with the oyster. Para lang may bind sila ng mas. Wala. No? Ah, baka nung ito na lang. Sige, buksan mo ngayon. We're not putting salt. Yes, no salt. Ito na yung pinakapang alat natin. So, as you mix it, makikita mo if you need more toge and chai, ah, uh, kuchai, to bind it together. Tinikman ko siya. Parang nakukulangan ako talaga sa uh, that umami. So, dagdagan ko konting-konting bagoong lang. Pero hindi siya... Hindi, parang nasa likod lang yung lasa ng bagong. I use a different brand of bagong. Uh, why? Kasi ito lang yung meron ako. Tapos, lagyan ko pa ng konting coconut para mas nati pa and mas matamis pa. Kulang pa. Pero masarap yung nasa ng tawilis, actually. Okay. Ayun. 
Pwede na doon mag-start mag-fry. So, kailangan natin, kailangan natin tumabi. What is this? <laughs> this is the husk. Yeah. Oh, the meat. The meat. Oh. Na, tikman mo, ha? Kasi, panagutin okay. pa natin ang konti. Sige, lakas naman yun. Basta, ay... ayun, 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 ayun na. Rai, rai. Tingnan mo ito, Rai, oh. Oyster cake. Oo, oh, yan yung eggless oyster cake. Yes, sir. Kinaan natin ito. <laughs> Yun na yung negotiations for tomorrow's lechon. Si ate yata yung nag, uh, meron siyang baboy na bagay para sa okasyon bukas. Marami tayong celebrant. So, I think, ayun, may, okay na, okay na? Maganda ba yung, okay yung negotiation? Okay? Patayin nila. Okay. Papakatay ko na ngayon. Oo. Uh, And then, ano ang po? gusto nila is sa kanila yung laman loob, perfect. Okay. Then, walang problema. And then, ngayon na kasi para pa sila ng 5 a.m. So, uh -oh. ngayon na. Pero isang sakong Uli. yellow. Yellow. Para ma-store natin. Nice. Na, and then, apat na sa... Huwag freezer. Freezer ba? Hindi. Para kailangan ano, relax siya. Pag freezer natin, mag-hard rock siya ulit. Uh -oh. So, ice lang para relax. And then, apat na sakong uling. Kasi hindi natin ano kung gano'n kalapag sa ako. Okay. Para, para lang sure na maluto natin okay. siya. Robert, Robert. Robert. Gano'n na kayo, gano na kayo katagal nagtitinda ng, nag, nag, naglalako ng banana chips? Bale, yan na po. Kalahating taon. Kalahating taon. Tapos, yung banana chips mo, na may, ano ulit? Okay, kainin mo muna, kainin mo muna. May latik ng nyog. Yung banana chips mo, Haluan kong konting niyog. Tapos... Para lang kasi medyo manamis-namis siya, kontrahan ko lang ng konting patis. O yung itsura niya, oh, parang talaga, wag, wag, oo, ituloy ko. Ako muna titikim. Huwag ganyan kasi. Babalik ko siya sa'yo. Pero iba na. Iuwi mo sa asawa mo. Pero tikman mo muna. Nagkana na. Pwede na may, may alak, ano? May dating na rin. Mm -hmm. Hindi gaya kanina na pure oh. sweet. So, maago-ago yung alak kami. Pwede mo na rin iulam. <laughs> Pwede na siya i-topping sa pagmilit sa manok, ha? Pwede. <laughs> Agree siya, agree siya. Okay, goods. Salamat, sir. Okay. Ingat, sir. Kanin, tama. Pwede yung kanin dyan. Actually, pwede nga... Ah, alam mong bagay dyan? I don't know really. Um, yung danggit? Comes a real sun shower. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Let's do four bananas. Ihawin ko lang siya. Tapos, pag lumambot na, ihalo ko siya dun sa coconut. Para natural talaga. Kasi, pinatikim ko kanina kay Chef AJ yung banana chips. Marami daw mantika. Gusto natin mag, uh, mag-heal siya. So... Effective! Effective! Masa siya! Ganda, oh. Oo. Maganda, maganda. Kulang pa sana yung nidi, pero nilabang ko na. Okay na yan. At least. May ito ganda ba yung technique mo sa pag-nidi? Hindi mo... Ah, hindi. Push and fold lang yun. Push and fold, ikot. One fluid motion. Ang dami. Ang dami. GP said that's the cleanest you can ever do. Galing. It looks pretty clean and pretty delicious. Oo, ganun sa sarsa. Pag mahaba pila pa. Para hanap ka natin. Totoo naman. This is pumpkin from the... the area? I think so, yeah. Mm. Wow. Crunchy, oh, sweet. Oh, a lot of that, man. Mm. Saging, where are you? The saba. This is Just grilled okay, from Baguio Mountain, man. It's still version. hot. And this is that. It's still steaming. Look at oh, that. My yeah. Still steaming. Oh. <laughs> That's so good. So good, Sarah. Na inis ako sa sarili ko. I meant well to feed my friend, and halos yung mga ibang gulay palang hindi pwede sa gout. 
Hindi ko alam. Kasi may beans. Yung beans yeah. lang naman? No, uh, okra. 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 Ang dami kong okra and eggplant nilagay. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. So yeah, guys. Kung lang pick pick lang. Marami. Thank you. Kung papa sa kay Uncle Winston yung ating oyster cake, big sabihin pasa ato yun. Kasi okay to. Okay, asik pa din yun. I'll take that. We'll take that. Here we go, ma'am. Thank you. Mm. Just a little bit. And the chuck so good. It's so good. The crispy part. Yum, yum. And then eggless. Uh oh. Yeah, eggless. Eggless. We glued the clams. Two kinds of clams. Actually, three kinds of clams. There's another one. This one. The timpla namin. Simple lang. Patis, bawang, sibuyas, mirin para tumamis. Masarap rin pag may luya. Tapos, butter. May butter siya. Ngayon, ang gagawin natin, dito tayo magsaserve. Halo ko siya dito. Tapos, ito ulit job. Yan. Hmm. So, I recommend Pandesal Ito mo yan Dip it Clams hmm. Hmm. Drop Oh, nice Hmm konting batis lang. Tapos, konting mirin para tumamis. Tapos, gisa. Pwede na yan. Tapos, ituloy natin yung oyster cake. Uh, tapusin na rin natin yung kalabasa. Yun o! Stop! Sarang kita, paano kumain natin? Uy! Perfect bite, perfect bite. Oh, deep, ah, pandesal, deep. Pandesal? Isa sa usaw dito. Oh, 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 Tapos dyan nyo ilalagay yung jet lobe nyo. Pero ako gusto ko talaga on the looser side. Hindi yung talo ah. Loose meaning maluwag. Ah, ano ah. Malabnaw. Sorry. Ba't ka na pag maluwag? Sorry, sorry. Ano pa na pag maluwag? Itlo, going in. Yan. Tapos saka nyo siguro ngayon bigyan ng ano. Ayan o. Kita mo yung ginawa ko. Hinila ko nga. Itlo. Ayan dyan. Tapos, garo nyo sa ilalim. Hilo nyo, sa basa. Oo, ayun. Ang kalubo siya ako. Pero kapag ginagawa, magdamas yun, di ba? Hindi ko lang. Buhay ata, itlog natin. Tapos yung kuli yung kuya dito. Ito, this is the charcoal. This is the charcoal for the lechon. I hope we are graced with the sunshine tomorrow. Oh, bracing yung preserve ka lang. Oo, yan. Medyo may miskom ng konti. Uh, yung oyster cake kasi kailangan namin i-serve a la minute, hindi siya uh, a la carte. And si JP, hindi nag-communicate sa mga fellow kusineros. So si JP nag-serve. So si Ninong Ryan nagtanong, O Chef, nagsuserve ka na pala? Sabi ko, o konti. Kasi syempre, palagi tayo sabay-sabay. Uh, my bad, my bad. And, um, pero, Actually, appetizer yun. <laughs> Meron ba tayong main course? And, ngayon, nakatenga lahat. Kung tingnan mo, nandun sila Chavi, taking shelter, sila rin. So, this is like a Vinte Part 2, which we're kind of used to. Ngayon, hat maghatid muna ako ng food kay Ninong Ray kasi para, you know, peace offering. 
Oi, 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 This is a do not judge by a do not judge a book by its cover. Yes. Oyster cake with a coconut pinakbit. Coconut pinakbit. And I wish you guys like it. I hope you guys like it. Yes. And we apologize for not communicating with the with the other kitchen. It's fine. And you know, tau lang, tau lang. Tau lang. Only lang. But I hope you like it. I hope you like it. No, no, do do. Okay, tell me the instructions. Please have the oyster cake first. Oyster cake first. Eggless oyster cake. Yes, by Joey. Hahaha. Sasa wala. Oh, the look of love is in your eyes. Hot sauce na gawa? Paano ginawa yun? Yeah, yung brand na Sunshine, old school na Chinese brand. Yan yan. Yan yan. Dito sa Pilipinas. Sunshine yung gamit. Sunshine. Yung murang-murang ano yun eh. Yes, yes. Murang low-cost na hot sauce. Yung sunshine free, classic yun. Try nyo, try nyo. Coconut pinakbit. Sabihin nyo nga, pinakbit siya. Pero meron kang smoked coconut dito. Yes, yes. I guess, I mean, pinakbit in a sense kasi nandiyan lahat ng mga gulay ng pinakbit. Pero yung tinta iba. Pang... Pang pakalma lang sa oyster cake na medyo heavy, no? heavy Tarap. fatty. I mean, fatty na dami magtika. Mm. Ayan, ayan, ayan. Sige. Uh, boys, mm. marami pa. Tawid Sige. lang kayo, ha? Mm. Go. Alam nyo na. Thank you, Thank you, Chef. You're welcome. Thank you, Chef. Okay. Play tayo. Ilagay ko yung sauce dito. Lagay natin dito. Tapos, lagay natin yung grilled shrimp sa taas. Yun lang. Eto, yung oyster cake na to, for the boys na to. Para... Kaya naman kakain. Lagyan ko pa ng hot sauce, ha? Okay. Malinamnam, no? No? Habulan nyo ng gulay. Replate ko na, ha? Tapos, para wala na talagang sayang, lagay ko lang dito sa gilid. Just in case yung gusto mag-gulay. And mamaya, pag nagligpit tayo, nasa isang pan lang. Isang hugasan lang. Kamatis, kamatis, onions, bell pepper. Pag na tayo magkanin, wag na tayo mag-starch uh, para marami tayong makain. Kasi sila... Mukhang masarap rin yung ginagawa nila. Dito si Chavi, wala. Tinatawanan lang na tayo ni Chavi kasi si Chavi na, nagsisiesta na. Okay, ligpit tayo, boys. Yun nga, sabi ni Sol, that, uh, kumbaga parang tapas-tapas. Parang pika-pika. So, dito muna kay Ninong Rai, then sa, uh, dito sa atin, then dun kay Chavi. So, or, wala naman sequence, eh. Kung saan mo gusto pumunta. And then, I guess base yan sa explanation. Tapos dun sila magbabase kung saan sila pumunta. Or ano yung uunahin nila. Good afternoon everyone. Uh, maraming salamat Lord na tumigil yung ulan sandali for us to eat our late lunch. lunch. Super late lunch. Early Super. dinner. Ninong Reg, gumawa ng homemade bread. Ah, yeah. Oo. So, ito yung mga pagkain natin. English-English daw. Ah, this is the food. So, basically, meron tayo dito ng pork steak. Pork shoulder siya. Ginawa ko ng two dishes. Usually, dapat tatlo. Pero explain ko bakit dalawa lang. Yung pangatlo kasi natin, para dun sa mga friends natin na they can't eat pork. Yung isang pork, ginawa ko, simple-simple grilled pork lang. And na-inspire kasi ako kamakailan. Kumain ako sa isang napakasarap na Middle Eastern restaurant. And yung hummus nila sobrang smooth. Sobrang smooth. Tapos sabi ko, medyo parang mashed potato to. Wait! So, ibig sabihin ba, pwede kong timplahan ng mashed potato para maging sauce? Kasi they're basically parang same structure eh. So, medyo ganun yung ginawa ko dito. Maasim at matamis. Uh, sweet and sour yung marination ng ating pork shoulder. Then, uh, creamy. Yung ginawa natin sa mashed potato, it's basically butter and coconut cream para more savory than your normal all-purpose cream. Nice. So, sobrang dami yung butter niyan. I think, 
one kilo yung potato natin or one one point two fifty pero one bar yung butter natin talagang mm-hmm. mm, sarap niya ngayon the other one is basically yung like yung ginagawa yung grilled pork salad mm-hmm. na ano nangyari yung vegetables natin ginrel natin nag cook down siya no minix ko siya na wala yung vegetables naging sauce siya naging sauce nag soften yung ano natin yung uh, bell pepper natin and yung tomato natin yung onion na lang yung present diyan uh, kapag kukuha kayo noon please uh, get the onions as well kasi matamis yan tapos the last one is uh, shakshuka it's ovo it's ovo vegetarian because eggs meron siyang eggs so so uh, mahi- hirap pa kung magluto ng vegan I mean, hindi hindi ako or vegetarian hindi, ay, hindi ako sana ay lahat yan yeah I can relate. <laughs> so I uh, extracted every uh, drop of flavor that I can. So not so much drop of flavor that I can. Ang lupet. So I grilled the vegetables, then I nanakaw ako ng mushrooms from the other kitchen, and gumawa rin tayo ng uh, homemade na sort of a flat bread. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, na pinroof natin sa uh, sa eye camper ni, ni 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 Sir Joel. Kasi kasi nakasarado lahat ng vents and mainit siya so very humid very hot sa loob at saka wala siya wala siya wala uh, siya sayang sayang no <laughs> ang i-introduce ko muna si Sol I will introduce Sol Oy. basically Sol is from the UK uh, he worked in a Filipino restaurant in London and then he worked at Kuya for a few months and now he's based here in the Philippines wow. <laughs> he's been here for a week yep. and he loves us he <laughs> He in in Dubai he already started loving us and one day he he said that he wanted to meet with us he had a, a presentation and then so he did his presentation and we're like what's the catch and towards the end of the presentation he said I would like to move to the Philippines <laughs> so here he is so he will explain our dish <laughs> so we made we oh, made, yeah, 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 we've yeah, made yeah. we've made one dish today <laughs> made with love so we've got uh, grilled prawns but we've got uh, calabasa ginataang, so we've got Ooh. coconut and um, pumpkin as well. So we've grilled the prawns, uh, we've made a really good stock um, using some of the leftover tawilis that we had at breakfast. Mm-hmm. So again, you know, zero waste, we don't want to throw things away. We can use that, make a really good deep umami with the stock. And then just to kind of round that out creamy, have the, uh, the uh, ginataang, have that coconut, just to kind of give it that richness. <laughs> then what we have is we've got blanched beans, we've got eggplant. Grilled uh, beans, grilled beans, like, mountain. Like, grilled, grilled beans, eggplant. Um, some peppers, some capsicum, onions, the tomatoes as well. Yes. Just because they're grilled, it means that it kind of gives that brightness to balance with the umami of the stock. And then, of course, you've got the grilled coconut as well. Smoked. And that, that smoked coconut, so you get that wonderful sweetness. It's just sort of complemented. So you've got that umami richness from the shrimp stock and the tawilis, the sweetness, the brightness from the tomatoes, and then all the veggies as well. So, so guys, basically, ginataan <laughs> kalabasa. <laughs> Pero, hey guys, seri- on a serious note, this is how Filipino food can be described. Why do we just say ginatang kalabasa? We can do it this way, and it's different, right? Yeah. It's para sarap sarap kasi. Ng ginatang kalabasa, para na bubulunan ako. So what we did is we just for your vegetables and your starch, uh, some fire grilled mm, marbled potatoes, cabbages, carrots. And then we got um, grilled uh, pineapples with uh, dry, uh, sugar and oh. nanay, what did you put here? Honey Plus, yogurt. and then homemade yogurt, homemade yogurt, yogurt and then the ones on top are candied sun-dried tomatoes. And uh, this one goes with uh, sour cream. Yeah. So you can oh, dip your, uh, you can just dip your. Oh, and then this one is yesterday. Yesterday once more. You know, right? You know, gave the short plate, yes, which is like around five kilos. Oh, so what we did is uh, dry rub that with mm, dried basil, uh, dried oregano, some rock salt, and uh, 21 spice. I saw that. Uh, 21 spice. <laughs> I know five, 21, I don't know. And then I fire grilled all the tomatoes, the onion licks, uh, the garlic, some um, mushrooms over there, my olives, yan, my smoked meat, and then. Braced. Yes. For How many hours? Very long time. Four? Four hours. Four? Four hours. Oh, yeah. So okay. this is it. Sakto look, sa ulan. Look, ang ganda. Uy, look, look, look. Wow. Oh. Okay, so that's for lunch. Okay. All right. So, Atak! So, living feet ito. Good start. <laughs> yeah, that's how you start, right? <laughs> when I smell it, parang, okay. 
<laughs> they grilled it first, day. Eh. So, all the aromas are there. Excited to be. Thank you, Mayor. Maraming maraming salamat po talaga sa lahat ng sumuporta sa feeding program na ito. Hindi hindi po namin kakalimutan ang kabait ng pipa. Mayor, yung daan sa amin, apat na taon nang ginagawa. Hoy, kumain ka na lang! <laughs> ha? Tonight, simple lang. Steak lang naman. Grabe. Uh, it's gonna be a carnivore night. Like, wagyu. Uh, anong ang gam anong mahaling steak yan, di ba? I think this is ribeye. Okay, ganito lang. May, may isang slab siya na lulutuin. Si Chavi, may isang slab rin na lulutuin. Ako, may a few wagyu sa ko na lulutuin. Gagawa tayo ng masarap na carbonara. Uh, pero papatulong ako kay Chef AJ kasi magaling si Chef AJ dito sa Kapulan. Ang bigat par! Siguro nasa ano to? 12 kilos probably? Okay. Ito yung ribs. So kung andito ito, may, may riblet siya dito. So dito naka-place yung ribs. So nandito yan. Kung yan, nandito, banta dito yung short plate, yung pinakalyempo ng baka. Sukat mo nga sa'yo? Hindi, baboy ako eh. Ayaw. Oo. Hindi, hindi. Kaysa sa iba pang manggaling. Sa akin na to. Hindi ka baboy, pangit ka. Oh my God. Mamahalin talaga to. Hindi talaga pwede ma-overcook to. Tapos look at that. Look at that. Japanese Wagyu strip line. A4 is like what in like a category of the car? A5 is a real strip, right? So A4 is the... Wait, wait, Should wait. I really name this in your vlog? Exactly. What type of car? <laughs> yeah! You gotta be careful. <laughs> okay, let's use the real strip stairs. Maybe it's a Bentley. Oh, there. Let's see. So look at that. <laughs> it's separate. Ko siya. Okay, J Job is your guy. We're together in this. Okay. So we have bacon? Bacon. I'll get from Chavi. Uh, Alright, pasta? Yes, I'll, I'll get your bacon. We need uh, bacon, we need egg yolks. Egg yolks. How, How much many? are we making for? For everyone? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I've never made that much for everyone. <laughs> Freak. See, Chef AJ is here. Okay. And this is an egg because it's a rock and roll. 500 grams of guanciale or ba bacon, basically bacon if you have. Okay. I know we don't have guanciale. I'm balanced bacon. Let's do. You know, let's do the whole. Let's do the whole. The whole tray. Crack it all. All right. Aba. Sabi mo hindi ka nag English, nag maybe maybe ka na jan. <laughs> Pwede naman, ah, baka ganito, abang may... And kausap niya sarili niya, ha? Alam mo, ngayon lang kami nakakatawa ng ganito. It's only now that we get to laugh like this. Huh? At Sarsa, we never laugh. I mean, I never laugh. <laughs> I'm, I'm a completely different person. Totoo. You know what? We're gonna make... We're gonna make this carbonara Filipino style. We're gonna, we're gonna use his... Mo there you go. Okay. This is what we're gonna use for bacon. Okay, perfect. I'll slice this for you, chef. Just let me know. Cut it into lardons. Lardons? Yeah. Wait, copy. Are you hungry, Aaron? Not yet. I could, I could use a PIA. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's do that. This is one of the best PIA. Yeah. That's why I said yes. You should put it on the, the barbecue. The heat it up. Yes. On the grill, just light. How many cups? Even though. We're gonna cook for everyone who's cooking on. Oh. Cook it on. My al dente. My fellow Americans. Parang kumaban dito. I'd like to take <laughs> this opportunity <laughs> even the to thank Nino Rye. <laughs> hey! Thank you, Mr. Wow. Obama! Oh my thank God. you! Beef belly. I actually don't know yet what I'm going to do with the belly. You can give Job some belly as well. Or mix it up some smoke and some... Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. But this doesn't have flavor though. We just want the fat. We just want the fat, okay. Yes, yeah, chef. Alright, alright, alright. Right. Sorry, I forgot what I went here for. <laughs> I was instructed by Barack Obama. Do you have alige? 
Yes, we do. Yes, but can I have it? <laughs> yes, you can. <laughs> okay. okay. It's, 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 oi. Oi, oi. I'm asking nicely. You just want the fat? Or the whole thing? You gotta, I mean, we don't need that much. Let's just take, take maybe one, one. We don't need enough. Maybe one set of years. Check out the slide. That's it now, bro. Check out the weight. Oh, wow. This is hefty. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's good. That's nice. Speak to Joe, Joe and Arnold. Accent. Speak to Joe Billy and Arnold Schwarzenegger accent. Joe, how many World Cups of water? That's enough. That's enough. Don't put too much water in there. Now we need salt, yeah? Get the salt! Hurry! Get the salt! <laughs> Bakit ka nanginginig? Huh? Wala siyang, wala siyang, wala siyang ano to, baril. Using, using salt for the carbonara sauce, we're gonna use like this. Yum! Wow! So guys, pag gagawa tayo ng carbonara, yes! Sarap yung bolognese niya actually. Kaya, siya yung uh, nirequest ko na magturo kay Job ng ita, uh, Carbonara. Anyway, what I was trying to say is that if you Filipinize our carbonara, then it can be with patis and it can be with longanisa or smoked meat. What's happening here, boss? Okay, I'm just making roux because I'm gonna make a tapoy reduction or um, peppercorn and tapoy sauce for the steak. Salute. Thank you, Jobs. So it's Organic red chili. I guess by the rent de bola. Was there any hard cheese? Uh, Parmesan, pecorino, grana padana. Grana padana. Here we go. Oh, okay, I'll do this. I'll do this. So, that, so I gotta get your yep. Okay. Actually, grab it. Actually, na appreciate ko yung yung pagkatao niya. So, eto. It's a nice moment. It's like a. You know when you go ask your school teacher in culinary school? Parang ganon. But in camp? Yes. Come on. <laughs> Anything can happen in camp. Yeah. Do we have yeah. cold water? Cold yes. Water? Yes. Oh, just, we'll just rip it a little bit. Yeah. Okay. To stop the cooking. Actually, I'm still thinking what I'm doing. The repetition yeah, stop the is like just meditation. I don't want to <laughs> let it cook over. Chepre, can you cook 10 kilos of steak under your awning? <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna make a little steak sandwich. This is um, beef belly, um, beef strips, then lagay tayong mirin. Tapos, soy sauce, kikuman. Pingingan nor seasoning. Tapos lagay natin kalamansi kasi Pilipino tayo. So para siyang feel jap in a way then it's stir fry ko lang siya and then gagawa tayo parang cheese steak sandwich this is a real philly cheese steak philly yeah steak. <laughs> okay okay if you're offering yes. yeah a hoagie so just need some cheese whiz better off some cry <laughs> then we'll add a little bit of nor seasoning to give it that Pinoy touch. Ooh. This is 
a block of kesong puti from Dairy Farm. Dairy Farm uh, Baguio. Salamat. Tikman natin. It's uh, very clean. I will eat with this. Tapos pa. Pakpan lang ha. Palutu lang. Rendered style. Uh, Maudong is crispy. We're gonna reserve them to make our Pinoy carbonara. First time ever making Pinoy carbonara, so let's see how it goes. We can do it, Jobs? Yeah. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> From Baguio. Kesong puti from Baguio Dairy Farms. This is, this is different from the uh, the native kesong puti. Yeah. Because our native kesong puti is squeaky, sort and, of like cheese curds. For and poutine. salty. Mm. Yeah. You can make like Filipino uh, poutine. Why, yeah. why do you think they made it different? Alin? Ito. Ito? Oh. Kasi I, I remember nung college ako, uh, sabi ng chef ko, uh, wala pang, uh, no one has the production knowledge yet to mass produce real queso pute. Mm. Yeah. So the best thing that we have then was yung Hacienda Makaluan queso pute, uh, mm. which is quite rubbery, parang siyang burata. Yes. Uh, parang burata, parang buffalo mozzarella. Pero it's not the same. Ito, this is crumbly, pero this is good. Yeah. Try the one that's melted. Ito. <laughs> ah, steady ah. pa rin siya, no? Ito. The real kesong puti, you can actually sear it without it melting. Yes. Without it melting. Mm. That's actually one of the... It's like paneer. Yeah. It's like paneer. It's like paneer, yeah. I told you it's mine. He said you were the Alton, Alton Brown of Philippines. No, that's not true. That's not true. Alton Brown is Alton Brown. No one can replace. Elton John. Taratado. Pasok yan, may kakat yan, ha? Lahat na mga... Lahat na mga kusinero pumupunta kay Chavi. Chavs, may cheese ka. Oh. Chavs, do you have smoked meat? Tapoy ka pa dyan? Yeah, no. Chef, are you still gonna use the tapoy? You can use it. Okay. Um, this one? Yes. You can use it. I will use the tandoy. Ah, really? Yes. This Just is a different kind of tapoy. This is not pink. Ah. What is it usually made from, the tapoy? It's heirloom rice. Oh, wow. Yeah, so it takes on the color of the rice. Interesting. So, yeah. Then, binigyan ako ni Mili ng bread. Uh, iihawin ko lang siya para mainit ko siya. I'll come here, coming here. Chavs, pwede ko bang pa grill lang muna to? Ooh, thank you. Mills, what are the breads again? Uh, the one on the left is uh, sandwich. Mm. Okay. Let's assemble it there so that it doesn't curdle. Okay, so we'll make the sauce and we'll keep the sauce in there? Yeah. Because uh, you know how we weigh and then, you know. What is Job? Uh, onion. Ingat ha. Mabilis siya masunog oh. Babaan mo siguro yung apoy mo. Tapos ito, hot pan. Lagyan natin ng butter. Hindi ah. Sige. Slice me yung slice me yun into half. Okay. Ah. It's... Hand one. So, simple niya ito. Soy sauce. Mirin. Sugar, sesame oil. Ah, tapos nilagyan ko ng spring onions. So never crowd the pan para ma maganda yung luto. Two batches tayo. May butter ako dito, mamaya ilagay ko to pag patapos na. <laughs> this is like state competition. We have like no, there's no, there's no competition. <laughs> there's no dick measuring here whatsoever. No, no competition. It's all in. Love. It's all 
camaraderie. Camaraderie. <laughs> Until someone it. wins. Except JP really wants to win. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. No, 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 I'm just joking. And, and, what, but yeah. really, yeah. What's that? What's that? What's that? That's a queso potato. Is that for the carbonara? No. No. Is that for the steak? Yes. A cheese steak sandwich. Oh, yeah, the Filipino cheese. Yeah, but it's, since I only have this much bread, it's going to be a canapé, not a sandwich. Oh, even better. <laughs> even better because we have a lot of food. Yeah, there you go. Or okay. even like a lettuce wrap. That was a lot of banter, man. In oh, English you know in English. <laughs> it's uh, critical when you cook steak. Tama naman, kasi you don't want to screw it up. And now that I'm feeling the steak, look, so here it's soft, here it's pa. So somehow semi-frozen pa siya. So I'm just massaging it, kasi kung i sear ko to, obviously, yung part na to, hindi maluluto, right? So, hintayin ko talaga na I get the texture all throughout. So, what people do when they make or when they prepare steak is from the freezer, they would defrost it in the refrigerator for about two days. I actually would somehow age it a little bit. So, I... In, a, in like a mesh, basta nakahang siya, nakaganon. I'd age it for like three days, para medyo mag-dry out ng konte, and then sear it. Medium rare. So, yung mga lahat na tao na hindi kakain ng medium, na hindi ko makain ng medium rare, go to the next booth, please. Because this is a beautiful piece of meat. You don't want, you don't want to overcook this. Next, the cool stuff. Insan hindi ko talaga overcook. Overcooked, but that's fine. Yeah, yeah. You want it to be quite a small bread. You don't want to mess with. Dapat ka ano? Wait, tete wagyu? Hindi pa, hindi pa. Kalakoy ito eh. Kalakoy ito eh. Belly pa lang to. Beef belly. Kaya, since na, di pa nga ako ready mag-plate, pero since nandito na siya, sige. Then, <laughs> mag magtatanong lang ako ano nangyayari. Eh, yeah, nakaka-pressure naman. May <laughs> kusinero sa kusina mo. Wait, ano yan? Bakit di lang yung tinapay? Chabi, ano to? Ito ba yung kamote bread? This one. The other one is kamote bread. It's under the meat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The other one is multi-green. Ito, ito. This is kamote? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, kamote bread. Okay, thank you. <laughs> so, gumagawa ka ng sandwich. Awesome. Sandwich. Okay. Ikaw yung guinea pig ko, ha? Oh, guinea pig. Uy, pig! Uy, uy, basher! Ay! Ito yung... Ito bawasan ko siguro, baka over... Ay, hindi, hindi, sakto lang yun. Ginipigin yung area. The perfect bike. May ano to? Anong sauce ito? Wala, yun lang. Wala, uy. Pareo. Zipel pack bike. Season ko ba? No, 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 no. Yes, si Sot si Lorena. Tung ako. Yes, hindi ko alam sila. Mahal daw ang kumain eh. Sige, si Sot ko. I'll finish off with si Sot. Yeah. Pero ano to, grilled beef belly. Sauteed lang yun. Tinimplan namin ng soy sauce, mirin, sesame oil, sugar. You know what's good? Kasi ano siya eh. You still feel the texture of the beef. Kasi usually, kapag beef belly, na it's quite, it's quite tough. Kailangan mo siyang i-brace para lumambot. Pero dito, sinote lang nila, then chin up nila ng maliliit. And, yeah, chop ko ng maliliit kasi medyo may konting chew. And yun nga yung maganda. Dahil may konti siyang chew, ramdam na ramdam mo yung texture niya sa bibig mo. No melted connective tissues, konting-konting melted fat, and you really feel na beef talaga siya, di ba? Ngayon, kung ayaw mo niyan, Bahala sabi mo, Chef JP, pero ako gusto ko yan. Pero ang amazing yung ano ah, yung queso puti pre ah, sobrang okay ah. Okay, so let's plate with the people, uh, for the people in front of us. Oh wow, <laughs> what do you know? He smelled it already. <laughs> My nose don't lie. Uh, uh, take this sir please. And give me. Yes. Everyone needs a shot. Wala pa siyang eating shot today. Joke lang. 
Ano Let's tawag dito, bro? Uh, Let's go. Filipino cheesesteak sandwich. And <laughs> that. And the song. Okay. Yeah. Put some meat in there. Yeah, put some cheese. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Come. Take okay. bread, bro. Beef belly, hindi pa siya actually steak. Yung steak ay mamaya pa. Mm. Yeah, what do you know? The brother is behind you. Sakit nung cheese, bro. Put that in my mouth. Oh my god. <laughs> so, ito na yung ating second batch. Na marami ng mga abangers. Oh, yes, yes. Um, Bilsa natin para hindi sila mainip. Oh, reset. Tapos, ready na tayo for steak and carbonara. One, two, three. Okay. Kain na na! Ito na! Ito na! Ito na! Ito na! Saan to? Dito ka. Gusto lapit na. Hindi. Habang nagsasalang ako, start na tayo dito. Para hindi sabay-sabay. Ayaw. Why guys? Tapos may carbonara naman eh. Yeah, so this is a Pinoy carbonara. So usually when you make carbonara, you want to do it fresh. Um, what, what I mean by fresh is that when you cook your pasta, you put it in another pan and you use that pasta that's already hot with your egg and cheese mixture mixed together with the hot pasta. But since we did it in advance just to get everything ready, we can't do that because our pasta is now cold. So now we're gonna try to reconstitute it. So we, I reserve the pasta water. We're gonna bring it to a simmer so that it's warm. Then we're gonna quickly throw in the pasta. My man Job here is gonna toss it up quickly. Then we're gonna add the egg and cheese mixture that way. And what makes it a uh, Filipino is that um, when we um, made this uh, onion mix here, this caramelized onion mixture, we deglazed it with tanduay. Drive safely. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna add some patis to this as well. Some chili flakes, black pepper, call it a day. Call it a night. You see, you want it warm, because if, if it was boiling, then it's gonna overcook the pasta, because the pasta was already pre-cooked out then. Oh yeah, that's a nice glisten. Right there. Look at that. And I'm gonna add some of this tandoai caramelized onion. Look at that. With the rendered fat from our smoked beef belly from Cha. Yeah. And then you're gonna add some of this, sir. Uh, <laughs> Just put, I'll, I'll tell you what. Put it in. Another one. Another one, keep going. One more. Yeah, and then mix. Slowly mix. Put the heat a little bit higher. Hi. A little bit higher. You don't want it. You don't want the eggs to curdle. If the temperature is too hot, then the eggs are gonna curdle. So what's in that mixture? Just eggs and cheese? Egg and cheese. It's usually like a hard cheese, like a pecorino or a parmesan. Or All right. Cheese. While uh, Chef AJ is finishing our carbonara over there, we shall start with the two. Sisimulan na natin yung ginawa mo. Yeah. Yung ginawa mo rin. The two on a seemingly unappealing pile of meat in front of me. Seemingly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, nagbigay yung kaibigan natin, mm -hmm. si Parang Carlos, na uh, ewan ko, stupid amount of meat mm -hmm. uh, for this uh, for this day, na hindi man lang niya nakain kasi umuwi na siya. Mm -hmm. <laughs> diba? well, again, marami marami salamat sa'yo. Uh, yung nakuha ko, honestly, I'm not the best at cooking steak. I'm not the best at identifying cuts. So I just uh, did my best, and if it's not good enough, I am sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, I just ate it as steak. Then I made two sauces. Because this is the two formula when it comes to steak sauce that I think works. One is leaning more to the savory side with a little bit of acidity and one with still with acidity and slight sweetness. 
Both of them are uh, same in function, just to cut through the riches of the protein. Uh, this one, the the sauce is gone now because of uh, you know Newton and gravity. Uh, it all went down to the bottom of the the plate. Pero the sauce is made from tapuy, uh, pomegranate concentrate, and honey. Uh, there's acid, there's alcohol, and there's sweetness. Na you know plays well with uh, with meat naman. Tapos uh, basically glaze siya. Glaze siya. It's it's a glaze that turned into soup later. So I suggest na pag kumuha kayo nito, uh, go to this one and scoop some of the uh, the juices that accumulated at the bottom of the the pan. And dito naman, it's basically alige butter. It's butter and alige. That's it. Crab pot and alige. And goes well with your uh, amlodipin and whatever heart medication you have. <laughs> and yeah, and eto, this is just langka that came from our friends here at the the owners of the campsite. It's very it's very good. It's very big, like like this big. I think it's what 10 kilos. Higit pa siguro. Pero it's very sweet. Uh, it's not a part of this. It's just something sweet. Towards the end, I don't know where the end is, but uh, kuha na lang kayo, kuha na lang kayo. Again, pwede nyo i-pair dito. Again, to cut through the richness, diba? So, yun. Sa atin naman sa banda dito, yeah. so what we did was, uh, at first, usap kami ni Ninong Rai, sabi ko, okay lang ba? Parang minasaker ko yung good piece of meat. So, ang approach namin is like a churrasco. Parang rinulad ko yung... Malaki. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so you have to yan, thin it I down. tried to, uh, to, do, to do it in a way na parang malaking barbecue. I'm just hoping na hindi, yung outside medyo crusty kasi makapal yung meat. So, baliktad ako ng baliktad. I'm just hoping sa loob is still juicy. So, for the sauce, uh, this is tapuy again. Tapuy and white peppercorn sauce. Uh, ano pa ba? At saka doon may salad ba? Another salad and then grilled uh, vegetables. Yeah, yeah, but oh. I cannot, uh, What's the salad made of? Take credit it's a salad, for salad made with raspberry dressing Oy, raspberry and then Baguio Dairy Farm cheese. Nice. And then there's sunflower seeds. Mm -hmm. There's. What else is in there? Yeah, the chip lamb. And a lot of love. Yeah. Yeah. At saka kung sa mga lahat na ayo kumain ng steak, meron tayong grilled salmon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's really up to you. Pwede rin mag grilled salmon na lang kayo. No? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We're firing we're, up the carbonara. Yung carbonara right we're plating individually. We have the steak first, and then punta lang kayo sa carbonara's area para to have the pasta. Para, as the chef AJ wants it, uh, alam ni Nitz. So, ano ginamit mo sa carbonara? Uh, spoink. 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 Spoink by uh, Ian Bernardes. Yo. He seasoned it with patis. Wow. Instead of just salt. Yeah. Caramelized onions has tandoai. Chili flakes. It's very, it's a very straightforward very honest to goodness carbonara, but just using Filipino ingredients. What uh, cheese are We used a, let's just say, queso. Ah, uh, yeah, we use a chili cheese. Chili cheese. Mm -hmm. Nice. Well, may surprise tayo. Okay, good. Okay. Halika, halika. Nandito. Uh, pwede mo ilagay sa harap niya. Wow. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's just really just because I gave ni Winston a magandang magandang steak, so I just we just really just seasoned it with salt and pepper and grilled it over charcoal. What is the steak? Na yun? Well, ito is an A4 wagyu mm. strip loin. Wow. Yeah. It's a, so this is um, cooked medium rare, medium rare. Yeah. All right. If medium rare is too rare for you, uh, you can go home. No, uh, you can try mine. You can try mine because mine has, uh, you know. You medium well, yes. and a few congratulations mm. beyond well done. Uh, <laughs> towards towards the end, so uh, we we have everything. We have yes. everything. Now we can say grace. Thank you to be able to celebrate it with good friends here in the campsite, and uh, thank you for all the meat that's been uh, thrown at us literally, yeah. and uh, been cooked uh, ten ways for all the steaks. So thank you again, uh, and uh, bless the fellowship tonight. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 Thank you. Party.
Parang so grabe, hindi naman namin we didn't plan this na magsa-stay kami. Uh, like all the way. Eh. Sino kibab sa